you're listening to KSC podcast this is a short crisp concise exam oriented edited editorial for civil services aspirants in this podcast we are going to talk about india's home grown alternative to the gps source for the content is reuters the indian government is pushing smartphone makers to enable support for its navic navigation system in new devices sold in the country from next year a move that has spooked the industry due to additional costs and tight time frame Now what is Navic? Navic or Navigation with Indian Constellation is an independent standalone navigation satellite system developed by the Indian Space Research Organization or ISRO. Navic was originally approved in 2006 at a cost of 174 million dollars. It was expected to be completed by late 2011. but only became operational in 2018 navic consists of eight satellites and covers the whole of india's landmass and up to 1500 kilometers from its boundaries currently navic's use is limited it is being used in public vehicle tracking in india for providing emergency warning alerts to fishermen venturing into the deep sea where there is no terrestrial network connectivity and for tracking and providing information related to natural disasters Enabling it in smartphones is the next step India is pushing for. Now how does Navic compare? The main difference is the serviceable area covered by these systems. GPS caters to users across the globe and its satellites circle the earth twice a day, while Navic is currently for use in India and adjacent areas. Like GPS, there are three more navigation systems that have global coverage. Galileo from the European Union, Russia owned GLONASS and China's Beidou. QZSS operated by Japan is another regional navigation system covering Asia Oceania region with a focus on Japan. India's 2021 satellite navigation draft policy stated the government will work towards expanding the coverage from regional to global to ensure availability of navic signals in any part of the world. Navic is as good as GPS of the United States in terms of position accuracy, the Indian government said in August 2022. Now why is India promoting Navic? India says Navic is conceived with the aim of removing dependence on foreign satellite systems for navigation service requirements, particularly for strategic sectors. Relying on systems like GPS and GLONASS may not always be reliable, India says, as those are operated by the defense agencies of respective nations and it is possible that civilian services can be degraded or denied. The government in 2021 said that Navic is an indigenous positioning system that is under Indian control. There is no risk of the service being withdrawn or denied in a given situation. Now India also wants to encourage its ministries to use Navic applications to promote local industry engaged in developing indigenous Navic based solutions. That's it for this podcast. Thank you so much for listening. To join KSJ India courses and to crack the IAS exam, visit ksjindia.com. You can also get a PDF of this podcast on ksjindia.com. Thanks for listening and do subscribe to our channel.